God is saying you today right now. Your mind is being imprinted with words of solace and calmness, which are dispelling the culprit that is causing you to be miserable. Even though the chaos of this world is driving you astray and plunging you into a pit of sin, where there is no refuge or hope, my love continues to be unchanging and unending. I want you to know that my heart yearns for you to come back to the place where you belong, where you can live a life filled with meaning and truth that I alone can supply. While you are making your way through life, I am aware of how challenging it is for you to fight against the evil that exists in this phone world. With that being said, I want you to be aware that there is a way forward, one that is enlightened by love and light. Regardless of how far you have traveled, I am prepared to welcome you back into my arms, where I will forgive, guide, and illuminate the path to a life that is rich in happiness, success, and significance. Evaluate the current course of action that you are taking carefully. The path of sin may provide momentary satisfaction, but in the long run, it will leave one in a state of pain and suffering. On the other hand, I want nothing more than to shower you with disclosures that demonstrate my unlimited love, so filling your life with happiness, tranquility, and hope. I want to do this every single day. I pray that your head is filled with comprehension. There will come a time in the future when the curtain will be drawn back, revealing the truth about the situation ahead of you. You should put aside your tendency to dispute and instead accept each revelation with an open heart. Despite everything that life throws at us, I am certain in my love for you because it is unadulterated and seeks nothing but your happiness. When you are confronted with challenging situations, my cherished child, you should be on the lookout for the covert ways in which my grace to redeem is at work, both the breadth of my affection for you and the joy that you bring me are indescribable. Your worries will be alleviated and your wounds will be healed, and all I want to do is hold you in my arms. There is no earthly parent who could ever be able to compare to the love that I have for you. Seek refuge in me if the challenges you have faced have worn you down and left you feeling exhausted. Let go of your burdens and watch as I provide you with the power you need. Are you grieving the death of someone or do you yearn for the company of new people? My embrace is always there to comfort you, regardless of how you are feeling, whether it be praise, anger, concern, or quiet and it does not matter. On the other hand, as we embark on this journey together, I am delighted to have you in my heart. This abstract concept does not hold any godhood for me. If you would like to accompany me on this voyage, please take my hand. My strength is revealed when I actively participate in activities rather than only observing them. In the event that something unfortunate takes place, such as illness, tragedy, or cruelty, we will be there for one another and assist one another in getting through it. Please do not hesitate to feel free to express your suffering and to find solace in my presence. Instead of listening to useless platitudes, you will discover that my strength is made visible in the midst of your suffering than you would have otherwise heard. Moreover, I undergo a redemptive transformation. As time goes on, my spirit will finally lead you to the light. I want you to know that I will continue to reinforce my love and presence for you through my spirit on a daily basis and that those who oppose you will finally disappear. In addition, I will ensure that you are placed in positions of honor and blessing. Take solace in this promise. The challenges you are facing are transforming into victories for you. 
I am just getting started with the wonderful things that I have in store for you. Prepare to greet them with gratitude and enthusiasm in your heart as you prepare to welcome them. Make your way with self-assurance to the throne of grace, where you will be presented with timely assistance and where your faith will be strengthened. I want you to let go of anything that is preventing you from completing my calling in your life, including offense, bitterness, envy, and everything else. Instead, I invite you to join me in expressions of praise, prayers, and humility. I will pour out my spirit on you in a measure of human intelligence that has never been seen before, and you will see the celestial regions open up before you. Even if others disappear, I will continue to exist eternally. You will be accompanied by miracles, signs, wonders, and profound experiences as you walk in holiness. Uh, you are walking in holiness. Those who disbelieve in your authority and might would be astonished to learn that you have money in heaven. Whether you have a small amount of faith or a large quantity of faith, I pray that your evenings are filled to the brim with delight and that you wake up each day with the knowledge that I will love and guide you. Unwavering faith at each new day brings with it even more opportunities than the one that came before it. Imagine that my arms are wrapping around you and that my gentle touch is illuminating your path and guiding your contemplation. I will reward you beyond measure with unexpected surprises that are beyond your wildest thoughts if you remain committed and never tire of our everyday exchanges. They will go beyond your wildest expectations. Your mind and heart should be quiet, your eyes should be closed, and you should allow yourself to be engulfed by the love that emanates from me. Learn to find comfort in these words. I have the utmost confidence that their profound meaning will offer you a great deal of happiness and satisfaction. I hope that you and the people you care about are able to be safe during this storm. It is possible that you will experience feelings of insignificance and insignificance in comparison to people who gloat about their material possessions. But as this era progresses, a new age of abundance and happiness will begin. It is important to keep in mind that the tight relationship that we have is unparalleled in terms of its value. The gem that is your heightened awareness of the spiritual realm is something that very few people can ever completely appreciate. You can always count on me to be there for you, ready to listen, to provide answers to any questions you may have, and to point you in the right direction. The inevitability of poverty and hopelessness is a consequence of longing after the material possessions of other people or the pursuits of other people that are not in their best interests. Don't lose sight of the path that we are on together. Recognize and welcome the possibility of personal development and change with each passing day. You can always count on me to provide you with direction and my affection for you is unchanging. It is important to have faith in the journey since it is full of gifts and significant experiences that will elevate your spirit and provide you joy that will last a lifetime. Ambitions, you are highly adored and well treasured when you are in my company. So walk with self-assurance during your time here. Have peace of mind knowing that you are already familiar with my lessons. I would like to extend an invitation to you to visit my domain, which is a safe haven where your voice is welcome with compassion and comprehension. The unfavorable comments that other people have made about you should be ignored today. Despite the fact that they may have succeeded in persuading you differently, you are not defined by what they say. 
putting an end to these misconceptions and acknowledging that I do not view the passage of time as a yardstick are both important. I do not place any importance on your chronological age. Rather, I take pleasure in your happiness. When I look at your spirit, I see unchanging purity, elegance, and trust. Your soul glows brightly within me. You are surrounded by power that knows no bounds. While you are rising to greet the day, stare at the stars with a heavenly zeal, and allow my Holy Spirit to envelop you in my embrace as you let go of the frustrations and challenges that you experienced the day before. You are going to be strengthened by my words. I am your healer, your guardian, and your sustainer. They will guide you through the difficulties that life throws at you and provide you with the knowledge to triumph over them with dignity. As each new morning brings with it new advantages, you should take pleasure in the acceptance and discovery of these advantages. Using a spiritual anointment could help you feel more at ease with your ideas and feelings. You do not have any reason to be concerned because your benefits are safeguarded. You will flourish in the plethora of my love and direction that this provides. In the fertile ground that I make available to you, your adversaries will make amends for the things that they have taken away from you in spades. You are graced and sanctify, brimming with zeal and enthusiasm and you are a blessing to those who are in your immediate vicinity. You have a compelling spirit that is brimming with vitality and energy. Every time you tell me that you love me, my heart is filled with true affection. You are really valuable to me, and I do not wish for any kind of suffering to befall you. Without the burden of regret or anguish, I would like to see your beautiful smile. I would like to see it. Therefore, in order for you to be able to receive the gift of life, I triumphed over every challenge that was thrown in your direction by going through the crucible and emerging victorious. I am here with you, silently but surely in the midst of all the confusion and pain that is going on. As you go through difficult times and are in need, my love will protect you like a shield. In spite of everything that life challenges you with, your faith remains unshakable and serves as a source of strength when confronted with temptation and doubt. Maintain your composure in the knowledge that you are being caressed by a God who loves you. For the reason that my love for you is limitless, I urge you to be unwavering in your statement of loyalty. Allow the love you have for me to shine a light on your journey, supplying you with strength and motivation. Even when you are feeling incapable, at no point should you allow fear or uncertainty to cloud your judgment. My love for you is unending and unchanging, and it will be there to help you overcome every obstacle and achieve every success. Please take a time to reflect on all the wonderful things that have occurred in your life and in the lives of your loved ones. As you continue on in life, my dear friend, I want you to have faith that you are being guided and protected by a greater power. Be encouraged and have faith in this. The road that lies ahead is replete with possibilities and opportunity. Have faith that God is good and that his love will lead you with grace even as you navigate life. If you follow his advice, you will be able to overcome any obstacle because you are loved beyond all comprehension, both in the now and in the future. There is nothing that can stop the limitless love that I have for you, and my all-powerful might is capable of overcoming any challenge that you might possibly face. Whenever I think of you, my most treasured asset and my most cherished daughter, you are in my prayers. Please, I implore you, 
to keep the flame of hope burning brightly within your heart. Create a light that is so brilliant that the storms of life will not be able to dampen your resolve or plant the seeds of anguish in your heart. It's possible that what appears to be a defeat right now but instead serve as the launching pad for a remarkable victory in the future. When confronted with criticism, maintain your steadfast resolve and resist the need to give in to fear. Have faith in me and be aware that you are extremely resilient and capable of overcoming any obstacle that may be placed in your path. The unbreakable will that resides inside you is more powerful than any adversary that you might encounter in this life. The conclusion is that you are not merely a survivor, rather you are a champion. Because of the love that I have for you, your spirit is meant to achieve greatness. I will always be with you, and my love and power will always be with you. Stay strong and confident. Know that I am with you, victorious victor, while you face the challenges that life throws at you. I will gently guide you and make sure that everything works out exactly as it should. It is important to keep in mind that I have bestowed upon you an unwavering will and surrounded you with devoted friends who will be there for you through thick and thin, sharing in both the highs and the lows of your trip. You can find solace in their companionship. You can strengthen yourself through the faith that links you, and you can fill your spirit with the limitless amount of my grace that is all around you and within you. You are saved by my grace, you are cleansed by my mercy, and your victory is guaranteed by my love. I want you to celebrate and be glad as you welcome the plethora of gifts and opportunities that are coming your way today since it is the first day of a new beginning for you. It is important to keep the past a distant memory. Take advantage of every opportunity that comes your way without any hesitation. My blessings have been bestowed onto your dwelling today, and they will bring about a change in your life. When you pray to me, I will listen to you, and as a result you will feel better every way. In order for you to be able to confront the highs and lows of life with self-assurance, Every spiritual weakness within you has been conquered. I infuse you with faith and resolve on all sides at this very moment. I admire you. By reaching out to you, I am able to calm your mind and spirit while simultaneously infusing you with vitality and strength. You are surrounded by my Holy Spirit today, and He is guiding and empowering you to face the future with unyielding strength and unbounded joy. The body, the soul, and the spirit will all be strengthened by me. Put the hurtful remarks that other people make to the side. The labels they give you do not define you. Refuse to believe the lies that have been taught to you that you are depressed, boring, elderly, or a waste of time. If you could tell me how old you are physically, it would be irrelevant. For you, my cherished child, you possess a magnificent soul because of your faith, purity, and elegance. Because I have the power to turn your requirement into an abundance of advantages, you should continue to have faith in me and have confidence in the promises that I have made not to be disheartened by this. I am sure that I will be able to handle any obstacle that you present to me. I, the God of healing and miracles, I am able to perform things that most people cannot ever fathom. Due to the fact that I am both powerful and good, I am able to heal those who are sick, rebuild broken connections, and forgive offenses. I am capable of doing everything I set my mind 
to. It's possible that the complexities of this world may cause my children to feel disoriented and terrify, and that negativity will choke the light that I have within them. Assuring you that my presence will never diminish is the reason I am here today. Take a moment to pause at dawn so that you can feel my vitality within you every day. My relationship with you is more personal than the air that you breathe. Just before you go to sleep, please allow me to enter your dreams. In spite of the great pressure that this world exerts on you to amass wealth and material possessions, I will provide you with a quality of sleep that is restful. Relationships, creativity, and service are the three foundations of life that ultimately yield the most valuable assets. What makes you so valuable is not your possessions or accomplishments, but rather the fact that you are mine with me. I painstakingly made each and every one of your cells. While you were still in your mother's womb, my heavenly fingerprints are all over you. Despite the fact that I am aware of your poor self-esteem, I am also aware that you are a fearfully and beautifully constructed person. With unflinching trust, acknowledge your divine worth and the countless opportunities that are waiting for you in the future. If you are experiencing sorrow and dread, you should know that my strength is seen while you are weak. When your concerns and fears began to consume you, you should turn to me. The gentle probing of your spirit was never meant to be critical, but rather to be filled with love. I am able to forgive your shortcomings with ease and I have unflinching faith in the boundless potential that you possess. Every soul is welcomed with open arms in the kingdom that I have created. In contrast to the world, where only a select few individuals possess the level of expertise necessary to compete fiercely and seize the spotlight, everyone is welcome here. There is a unique spot in heaven reserved for each and every person, and each and every one of them possesses unique abilities, regardless of how black the night was or how close you felt to giving up on the future. I had meticulously planned for you a future that was full of righteousness and success. Although there have been voices that have whispered doubts and convinced you that I have abandoned you. My love for you has never faltered before. My heart broke when I saw you ensnared in the shadows of mistakes that have long since been forgotten. I pursued you nonstop and did all in my power to prevent you from plunging from the brink of hopelessness. I did everything in my power. I would like you to know that the suffering you are going through the result of my rescue is only temporary, and that the dazzling love that I have for you will bring peace to your wounded spirit. Since that fateful day, your life has been a symphony of thanks, a hymn of thankfulness, the very essence of gratitude. In the midst of storms of agony and fear, my love remains unwavering, directing you through the darkest of nights and bringing you closer to the dawn of a new day that is filled with hope and joy. Even though you have experienced sadness and misery, my love has remained unwavering, serving as a steady lighthouse that guides you through the storms of life. A demonstration of this is the sense of peace that comes over you, and you know you are once again in the protection of my embrace. You may be certain that I will make sure to keep a close eye on you at all times. You can relax knowing that you are protected while you are mine. It is sufficient for you to believe what I say and to allow yourself to be engulfed in the tranquility and peace that I offer. Experience the gentle utterance of my Holy Spirit as I deeply appreciate each 
and every aspect of your life. I wish that you were able to replace your fear and anger with self-assurance and honesty on a daily basis. Your spirit will be refreshed and fortified with unwavering determination, and I pray that this happens. You can always count on me to be there for you whenever you require a safe haven so that you can escape the storms that life brings. No matter what happens, I will never abandon you or break my pledge to be there for you. I will always be there for you. We have a connection that cannot be broken because of the challenges that put your faith to the test. Your indomitable spirit has left a deep impression on me. During the course of your inquiry into my personality, you have made some bold assertions. We have reached the end of the period for aimless wandering. At this very moment, you are entering the pinnacle of your fate. Even though you are in the depths of despair, when you choose to resist giving in to feelings of melancholy and hopelessness, I believe that your inherent worth and one-of-a-kind purpose are heightened. Do not hesitate to accept the joy and affirmation that I am providing at this very moment. My dear, it is imperative that a divine intervention take place right at this particular time. Participate in my endeavor to heal broken lives and mend broken hearts by coming to be a part of it. I invite you to acknowledge my unlimited grace, which wins above humiliation and responsibility. In spite of the challenges you are facing, you have the ability to rise above them and walk in the light of my love. Since you are cherished, unique, and chosen, you have the capacity to make a constructive contribution to the world around you. Unyielding in your determination to accept the liberty that comes with being God's children and to allow my spirit to fill you to the brim in all aspect of your existence. You must be unwavering in your determination. Due to the fact that these realities serve as my basis, my love for you reveals the heart of the Father to the entire world. During times of difficulty, my dear buddy, your love and unwavering faith are like water to my soul. Thank you for being there for me. Even at the darkest of times, you are able to cling to our connection, which not only provides you with hope, but also leads you to a new day that is brimming with vitality and clarity, vision. Dearly loved child, despite all the lies and concerns that are all around you, you should get up and smell the coffee because a fresh day has arrived just for you. You can put your trust in me and rely on me no matter the time of year. At all times you should have faith in me. Through the people in your immediate vicinity, I make my boundless love known to you. My compassion and generosity are always on the point of filling your life to the brim, just like a gentle rain. It is imperative that you do not be afraid to seek assistance in the event that you believe you are going through a difficult period. Whenever you have a need for me, I will be here for you. Take into consideration the fact that requesting assistance is not a sign of your strength. You are an ordinary mortal who is attempting to navigate a world that is full with challenges. Despite this, you should take solace in the knowledge that if you place your trust in me and keep the commitments I make, everything will turn out just as I have planned it to. When people put their faith in me, I want them to know that my goals are pure pleasant, and without flaws. Nevertheless, I also want them to understand that every single person goes through adversity at some point in their lives. I implore you to put your complete trust in my expertise and understanding, because I am perpetually by your side, directing you through each and every challenge and achievement. In these times of impatience, 
I understand your need for speedy answers. Please accept the precision with which I predict the timing of my responses. At no point should you lose up hope. I am doing everything in my ability to safeguard you from any potential harm. You are conscious of the fact that traveling on this journey has the potential to bring about tremendous personal growth as well as the acquisition of invaluable guidance. Never stop going forward. The power of tenacity and patience to change things is something that should never be underestimated. Know that even though you are unable to perceive the specifics of my divine plan for your life at this moment, it is already in the process of working its magic. Encourage yourself to be courageous and persistent, my dearly cherished, for it is in these characteristics that you will discover the ability to triumph over any obstacle. You must not allow despondency to take hold of you, my sweetheart. You must keep your spirits up and your dreams intact. It is important to keep in mind that the sun will always rise again, regardless of how discouraging things may become. Belief should be maintained alternatively. One should visualize a bright and exciting future. You should have trust that the bright future you see will come to pass. It is important to maintain your trust even if you are unable to see anything happening at this moment. I am intervening in your life in a way that is both active and individual. You will triumph in every situation, my sweetheart. If you love me and adhere to the directions that I give you without fail, in the not too distant future, you will come to look back with awe at the transformation that I brought about bringing beauty from ashes and richness from misery. A gentle stream of my healing touch flows over you like water, helping to remove your sadness and anguish and restoring your soul to its original state of whole. As a result of being rejected and betrayed, you have experienced the pain of deep scars that appear to be impossible to repair. I have witnessed every single act of generosity and every single one of them. You have been courageous in touring out your love to people who've been unappreciative or disinterested, and the sacrifices that you have made out of love are a testament to your dedication. As I continue to work on the hearts of those individuals who have previously rejected you, they will eventually see you for the precious diamond that you truly are. Due to the fact that you shine as brightly as a thousand stars, in my opinion, your worth will be recognized and cherished. It has been much too long since you have been able to escape the vicious cycle of want and poverty, which has been accompanied with challenges and failures at every stage. On the other hand, you should get ready for a strong wind of riches to blow over you, and then you will realize your freedom. When you move forward with trust, propelled by the vision that is produced by my promises, you will find that new doors will open for you, that there will be an abundance of connections, and that you will be presented with unexpected opportunities. Allow your passion for my kingdom to serve as a driving force, even if the adjustments are quite minor. Keeping your radical love, being compassionate about telling the truth, and allowing behaviors that are self-serving to break down walls of division are all important things to keep remember. I am able to see everything and understand the entire story. Therefore, you should have faith in the judicial system and applaud me at the end of the story. I shall confront the harsh truths of the world with the fire of human compassion that my love has stoked with the goal of fostering reconciliation is my primary focus. Put the question to yourself. Because of this concept, I am compelled to think about the aspects of it 
that I enjoy and those that I dislike, the incentive to investigate and inquire, as well as the encouragement to embrace ambiguity rather than avoid it, is something that I value significantly. Rather than blindly adhering to religious doctrine, it is invigorating to hear of a partnership with God that places an emphasis on learning and advancement. On the other hand, the idea that truth will endure the test of time, even if it appears to be in opposition to reality or the Bible, is something that causes me to hesitate. Despite the fact that I am aware of the significance of faith, I am of the opinion that there ought to be a connection between faith and reason. An unquestioning allegiance can occasionally result in destructive thoughts or behaviors of some kind. I also believe that it is vital to acknowledge and handle the obstacles and challenges that we face rather than simply hope that they would disappear through faith alone. This is something that I believe is essential, despite the fact that I like the emphasis on dealing with the world in a joyous and optimistic manner. In general, I believe that this concept contains a number of insightful ideas, particularly those that pertain to the acceptance of uncertainty and the cultivation of a partnership with God that is founded on learning and advancement. On the other hand, I am of the opinion that it is of the utmost importance to keep a critical and balanced viewpoint during our journey, taking into consideration both faith and reason. It is imperative that you incorporate this commitment into your lives as if it were your very own individual existence. Gather your wits about you, because nothing stays the same, and for every deficiency, there is an unlimited surplus. Be unwavering in your faith, for you are going to experience something remarkable. Break through with unwavering faith. I promise you, above all else, that I will always be at your side, guiding you along the path you have chosen, encouraging you, and bestowing upon you favor and riches that are beyond anything you could have imagined. To my dearly beloved, I ask that you let your heart to be completely open so that you can take in the abundance that I am prepared to provide into your life. I will be composing a symphony of benefits for you, and they will have an effect on every aspect of you, from your spirit to your dreams. My goal is to motivate you to achieve remarkable achievement beyond your wildest dreams. You are more than just someone who benefits. You are a conduit through which heavenly favor flows abundantly. You are a conduit. Your life will be a manifestation of the boundless generosity that I am anxious to bestow onto you via unwavering faith. It is possible that everything you have ever dreamed of may come true. The darkness that has been on your path will be removed by his hand. There is a gentle whisper of safety from your heavenly Father, who will safeguard you from any harm that may come your way. It is recommended that you recite the phrase, My heavenly protector watches over me with absolute certainty against others. As for me, nobody can take over. Watch what you say and refrain from using words that could cause harm to others. Do not spread false information or ruin the reputations of others in the event that you fail to keep your word and speak negatively about those who assist and serve you. You will be able to damage the trust of those who are financially dependent on you. Imagine that you are in my position. I have come to forgive you for your transgressions and to heal your heart that has been shattered. I am waiting for you in prayer. I have a deep desire to be able to liberate your spirit from the burden of guilt and remorse. As soon as the sun rose, I gave my life, while I was still hanging on the cross, 
and I rose again to set you free from the shackles of intellectual and theological oppression. It is possible for fatigue to have an effect on the entire person, including the body, the soul, and the spirit. Absolutely no one is immune to feeling exhausted or looking for solace. Despite this, even the most devoted of my employees have made their way to this place in order to humbly confess their crimes and gain forgiveness. Through their collective tenacity, they were able to triumph over challenges and emerge victorious. Remember that no matter how good or awful things get, they always work out for the better. This is true regardless of whether you are feeling fatigued, like you have fallen, like careless words have spilled out of your mouth, like inadvertent injury has happened to those you care about, or like you are battling with bad habits. My love for you is exceedingly more than anything that you are capable of comprehending, my little child. I am here for you in your times of intimate need, ready to wipe away your tears, heal your wounds, and guide you into a life that is filled to the brim with success and reason. It is imperative that you do not let the difficulties of life too overshadow the depth of my unwavering love for you. There is simply no way that I could ever abandon you. There is no love or fervor in my heart. Without any prior knowledge or explanation, put your faith in my unchanging presence, for I am here to help you navigate through every difficulty and challenge that you face. In the knowledge that I am devoted and committed to your well-being, I encourage you to view the difficulties as chances for personal development and transformation. Find solace in my reassuring embrace and gain courage from my unwavering direction. Uh, you are in the midst of the most hopeless of circumstances. Keep your faith in me without wavering, and you will see how I transform every challenge into a stepping stone on the path to an unimaginable amount of happiness and prosperity. Find great consolation in the boundless tranquility that emanates from my presence, and permit the all-encompassing embrace of my loved to unveil your true nature in its entirety. In the midst of the storms that life brings, seek refuge in me via the holy communion of prayer, for I am your rock-solid foundation and unchanging sanctuary. Not only should you look for alleviation today, but you should also cultivate an insatiable need for spiritual revitalization. Take some time to think over these words and make a commitment to rekindling your faith with all your heart. Despite the fact that the difficulties you are experiencing may have made you less resilient, the time has come for you to reevaluate your situation and allow my transformative power to wash over you. We are getting closer and closer to the latter stages of this period of adversity, and the days of suffering will soon come to an end. Keep in mind that the benefits that come your way come from the depths of my love, and they come when you least expect them but they always have a purpose and meaning behind them. You can put your faith in my steadfast presence and let my unflinching dedication to lead you to a beautiful and prosperous finish. It is you, you must maintain a strong and unwavering faith in order to ensure that you will not lose sight of me even when you are surrounded by affluence. Despite the fact that you are engaged in a spiritual conflict. You should be aware that I am with you and that your divine creator has you in his hands. Pray without ceasing, for there are many marvels that have been concealed that will gradually become unveiled. It all boils down to your faith, your desire, and your prayer life that you maintain consistently. The hands of time will change 
and I will work through you to offer others with useful resources, comfort, healing, and divine favor. If you seek me throughout the day, defend me in the darkness. 10. Summon me early in the morning for serious supplication. Then the hands of time will shift. Maintain your resolve and fight for the things that you believe in, and you will be rewarded with a multitude of benefits. Permit me to respectfully persuade you to let go of the burdens that have been resting on your soul for a very long time. As soon as you saw light, my love for you began to grow deep inside you. And today, as you seek my face, I will rekindle your faith in me. It is not appropriate to describe the burden of humiliation because it transcends beyond faults. The fact that you feel the reassuring warmth of my affection surrounding you is evidence that you are remarkable and adored exactly as you are. A love that is limitless and has no boundaries. Am I the only person who loves you with every single fiber of my being? Have you ever been promised by another person that they will always be there for you and offer advice? Upon waking up, take a seat, close your eyes, and allow yourself to be engulfed by the boundless love that is contained within your heart. I ask that you forgive yourself and make room for me to continue to exist within you. My goal is to be the most approachable environment in your life, one in which my unwavering presence can provide you with an infinite amount of comfort. It is important to keep in mind that even when you are feeling weak, my mercy, forgiveness, and power are always accessible upon you. As I lavish you with benefits and answer to your demands, I take pleasure in keeping connections with people from all over the world. I would like to know if it is possible for me to detach my love for you from everything else so that it does not change and remains consistent. Despite the fact that you continue to dwell on past hurts and uncertainty, you should take action based on this reality. In spite of the fact that you are confronted with difficulties on a daily basis, I am here to love you and to work tirelessly to make a difference in your life. I have a good understanding of the difficulties you face. Relax and let a sense of calm to flow over you as you pay great attention to my voice as I deliver these words of assurance, describe in great detail the extent of my affection for you. In the same way that you guard the people you care about with all of your strength, I keep a watchful eye on you with an unending love that has no limits. Stand between you and them, an amount of love that is never seen yet is boundless in volume. In spite of the doubts that may be plaguing you, take comfort in the thought that my love is endless and reflect on the marvels that you have witnessed. Encourage your faith to become unyielding and unyielding. I am giving upon you an extraordinary ability, and as a result, even if the challenges that you are facing appear to be insurmountable, they will no longer be able to defeat you. Ascend, my dear, and break through with the bravery and strength that I give you. I will help you. You are going to be victorious over the ambitious forces that are working against you. You will leap over challenges with a happy attitude. I pledge to you that no amount of negative news, no matter how severe the clinical verdict, or even prophecies of family trouble will ever be able to slow down your determination. Proclaim to me that your solution is unwavering because I am certain that it will never be able to do so. Putting an end to the rumblings of despondency that proclaim your challenges are insurmountable is highly recommended. In order to offer you words of encouragement, and to reassure you of my unshakable support, 
I have brought you here today, you should not be terrified of the apparent might of your adversary. Rather, you should be afraid of the power that is contained within you. Even if they make an attempt to scare you, you will not give in because I am by your side. You will be guided through the darkness and your route will be illuminated with hope and assurance along the way. Your intellect, soul, and spirit will be strengthened if you put your faith in my teachings and commands during this time. At this very moment, you are being guarded and filled with my Holy Spirit. Thus, you should be bold and powerful. Due to the fact that I am the all-powerful, you will never again be vanquished, and when you combine your power with mine, you will become something that cannot be stopped. There is no amount of hostility from the outside world that can take you down, my child. I have protected you from the consequences of this worldwide crisis by enveloping you in my sacred robe and shielding you from others. Continue on your journey with self-assurance knowing that I will never leave your side and will guide you to the successful accomplishment of your holy mission. I beseech you to declare with assurance that I am holding your heart in my hands and to announce with optimism that your faith in me is unbounded. I beseech you to express these things today. Permit there to be unshakable confidence both now and forever about the infinite depth of my love for you, regardless of the storms that life may bring. Having this love is something that you were born with, thus it is automatically yours. Even if you are skeptical or detached, you cannot reject the fact that it is true. Recognize that these challenges are nothing more than the challenges that life throws at you in an attempt to quench the fire that is already there within you. It is important that you keep your faith strong and unwavering, Tan, that you let the soft light of my presence to lead you through the darkness and enlighten your way with hope and assurance. This is the signal that you have been looking for, and I have confirmed it by using these formulas. Let out a cry whenever you are experiencing anxiousness, and behold, I am here to reassure you, because you possess such exceptional talents. It is imperative that you maintain your dedication to your quest and do not give in to the gloom of hopelessness or the never-ending cycle of failure. Embrace the peace that I bring and allow yourself to be completely submerged in the boundless delight that I provide. My pledge to you is that you will never run out of love. I want you to concentrate on the compassion and warmth in my voice, and you should also be aware that once you have forgiven your previous transgressions, Nobody will remember them by steadfastly adhering to my teachings and showing concern for your ideas. You have demonstrated a high level of skill. You are a person of uncommon virtue, and somewhere within you lies a wellspring of unadulterated and profound feelings, a heart that is both exquisitely beautiful and profoundly profound. It is important to keep this fact in mind whenever the burden of difficulties attempts to overpower your spirit. Always maintain your determination for the people you hold dear and the dreams that will lead you to success. For the very reason that you possess such great characteristics, you must maintain your dedication to your mission and resist the temptation to give in to the gloom of hopelessness or to the never-ending cycle of failure. Embrace the peace that I bring and allow yourself to be completely submerged in the boundless delight that I provide. Solitary, I have come to show you the method to bring everything into alignment with my divine will. Putting everything that is beneficial to you in your right hand and 
letting go of anything that is preventing you from moving forward. If some people decide to deviate from the route you have chosen, you should not let this discourage you. Instead, you should let them go with grace because their choices will cause them to miss out on the many pleasures you expect. In times of plenty or shortage, you should not be concerned and you should be wary of the seduction of labor and material items. The superficial attraction of short-term profits is so appealing that many people give in to it, even if it means sacrificing their eternal destiny. Please know that I am always by your side, your heavenly Father, and your devoted Shepherd. I am here today to bring you restoration and deliverance so that your spirit may be at peace, so that you may thrive, and so that you may be lifted out of your current difficulties with my unlimited compassion and grace. I am here to bring you these things. These benefits will be with you, and in the eyes of those who have rejected you, even the most fundamental meals will be transformed into extravagant feasts. Even when it appears as though the sky is closing in on you and hopelessness is about to take you whole, the life that you and your family are living will be filled to the full with joy. Always keep in mind that you are not alone. Even in the most difficult times of your loss, you are going to seek solace and direction for me in times of need and you will come to me. It is important to keep in mind that my love for you is limitless, and there is no way that one could possibly be denied access to the gates of heaven. I will never forget the devotion I have for you. I will always be by your side. It is possible to find a solution to everything, and the miracle that you have been looking for is right around the corner. Always keep me in mind when you are feeling anxious and exhausted. I want you to know that I am always at your side. Even when you are experiencing feelings of fear and despair that threaten to overwhelm you and when doubt tries to weaken your will, there is never a time when you are genuinely alone. In the event that you begin to experience feelings of solitude, let your tears to be filled with delight, for my love envelops and reveals you, leading you with my consciousness. You can have peace of mind knowing that I have ordered the heavens to send angels to battle for your cause, bring joy to your heart, and remove sadness from your life. Even when difficulties threaten to crush you, when you pray to me and ask for my assistance, I will provide you with insight and comprehension, shedding light on the way out of the challenges you are facing. Acknowledge the fact that each and every prayer you repeat has the power to move the heavens and love and relax yourself without any restrictions. Your petitions are of tremendous significance and power and I'm able to make use of all the resources available to me both in heaven and on earth, to fulfill all of your requirements. I would be devastated if any of my children were to find themselves in a difficult emotional state. I believe that you will seek solace and direction from me in times of need, and I expect that you will come to me. It is important to keep in mind that my love for you is limitless, and there is no way that one could possibly be denied access to the gates of heaven. I will never forget the devotion I have for you. I will always be by your side. Besides within you, nourished by the love and direction that I provide. In the event that you entrust me with your heart, I will care for you in ways that have never been done before. You can have peace of mind, my sweet child, for I will encircle you with my angelic creatures. These creatures will watch over you and your loved ones while you are encased in my protective cocoon. 
making sure that nothing terrible can happen to you. Your strength is unwavering because I am your God and your everlasting protection. My all-powerful fingers will always support you, and your strength will sustain you forever. It is not necessary for you to allow fear to penetrate your heart. Instead, you should recognize that you will not be terrified by the blackness of night or the light of day, nor by the specter of sorrow that is not apparent to the naked eye. I maintain a constant eye on you with unwavering care, giving you with a place to relax in tranquility and a safe haven for your troubled spirit. Put your trust in my assurances and find comfort in the fact that I am always faithful, my cherished son and daughter. When you are in the thick of the storms that life brings, my boundless love will be your fortress. For this reason, you should not be terrified of the challenges and constraints that are still to come. Do not pay attention to the cunning prods that the adversary is giving you. They are planning their next move in order to sow the seeds of concern. My love and guidance have helped you develop the insight to differentiate between good and evil, as well as the strength to triumph over any obstacle that's standing in your way. The arena, a beacon of love and hope in a world of conflict, was selected to represent the venue Love me with every fiber of your being, remaining unwavering even when others are going through difficult times. I am very moved by your loyalty, and I am writing to you right now because of the unshakable commitment you have shown to both your family and your country of origin. It is not true that your aspirations have diminished, despite the fact that you may assume they have. I am the one who has the power to rekindle your aspirations and rekindle the fire that burns within you to pursue them with a renewed level of fervor. With the passage of one year, you will accomplish objectives that, in the past, appeared to be unattainable and improbable, even if they were buried deep inside your conscious mind. It is important to have confidence that your case is not yet resolved. If you are feeling crushed by the weight of despair, the grace that comes with forgiveness is something that those who refuse to forgive have not experienced. Therefore, you should avoid interactions with them. Despite the challenges you face, you are destined to triumph over them and shine as a beacon of love and hope for everyone. You are destined for greatness to the point of prosperity. 10. Lots of it. You can put your faith in my direction since I am always at your side, guiding your actions in accordance with my absolutely flawless plan. If you are willing to pray with all your might and open your heart to my message, then I will reveal the truth of my promises to you in the context of our friendship. At the same time that the sun rises and sets, my promises are unchanging and full of vitality, and they are prepared to be fulfilled. In the manner of a shepherd, I will lead you with gentleness into a place that is abundant and prosperous. The door that I am opening for you is not only symbolic, rather it is a solid reality that is waiting for you to hold it in your arms. As you embark on this trip, you should get ready to witness the realization of your dreams. You are going to come across people who have the same vision as you do, and together you are going to construct a future that is rich in prosperity and abundance. Have faith in me and let my unwavering love and direction to guide you to the path that is meant for you. An abundance of my love and direction poured out. I am here to remind you that I am here to assist you once more. So open your eyes and stand tall. You can let go of your worries because I am here by your side, 
ready to offer you consolation and comfort whenever you are in need of it.